I'm going to show you how to make Gudetama. Let's go. This is my original Gudetama. Obviously, he's already done. This can be made off of anything. I had an already black surface, and I just painted this white. But if you don't, you can just paint the black um, background and then his white yoke. For him, it's pretty straightforward. Just find the rock that's the shape of the egg you want. Say I wanted a circle one, however, I would either use a marker or a piece of paper and just draw his face on that. For this, I drew on it with marker, which I wouldn't recommend because it just comes right off onto you. You can't see it right there. Um, so use paint. It's probably a better idea. It'll probably stay better. And then I used <laughs> I used enamel paint, I think it was. That's why he looks shiny. Um, so that's number one. And then I have white clay-like stuff, I think it is. And I am going to see if I can form that into a egg yolk. And then I'm not sure what I'll do for the top yet. Okay, so I made the little shape. What I did is I took a circle and then I added another circle and I molded them together and that's why I have two large ones and two small ones. Now, for the glutama itself, I could either just take my yellow marker, draw his little circle, or I could mold a little body. I'm thinking that I'm going to mold him a little body because that's cute. And then I'll color that with marker or could also just color the clay now and mold it and then it's just everywhere throughout the whole Budahama. Bonus craft. Okay, so I'm gonna make a name place. So I have foam, and then I have these paper strips. You don't need them. And then I have some uh, owls. I just forgot they're called. Then I have name stickers. It's not gonna be able to be my first name because I have A in my first name, um, and I have no A's. I'm not sure I can spell my... Nope, can't spell my last name either. Not sure what I'm going to spell. So you can actually spell anything you want, obviously. Because it's just letters. But what I'm thinking is I'm going to do is... I'm going to use my pieces of paper. And I'm just going to fold them over. Like so. Can't see, can you? Like so. 
and then I'm going to make sure that the end ones are over so that it ends up uh, covering the whole thing. And then I'm using tape. You can use glue or whatever you want. Ta-da! And I'm just going to do that a whole bunch of times. Now that I've finished this, I'm going to move on to the back, which some people would say, well, you don't have to do anything to it because it's the back, but I want to cover it up with some foam so that it's nice and pretty back there, too. Here's the front of it, and here's the back of it. 